Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf, you're one and only, and today we're going to be playing Valkyrie Connect. Found this game on Google Play, and we're going to be trying it out and see how it is. We're going to be doing some recording before I have to go to work, so... Yeah, let's at least get these videos out. It's probably going to have me download. If that's the case, I'll just pause it and we'll just take it up from there. But yeah, it seemed like more of an auto game to where... When they full up their bar, they use their ultimate skill. And you probably have like a little bit of like auto abilities they use too. But that's at least what it looks like. I've been wanting to try this game out for a while, but sadly the devs do not like emulators. So it's a good thing I can actually do this on the phone. Like there there are quite a few devs who are against emulators, apparently. Way more than usual. But most devs understand that, you know, battery life and phones overheating and stuff like that. So they allow them. Some devs are too lazy to actually even deal with it, so. <laughs> yeah. What the hell are we watching? Let me turn it up a little bit more. You know, I've noticed a lot of games use that, use this kind of like same weird animation art style. Or it either just seems familiar. This game must be really old because this, this background sounds, sounds pretty old. Well, background music sounds pretty old. With the way it echoes like that. Uh, let's see. I, mean, I can say I like their portrait art, at least. Okay. Alright, got our team. This guy looks like a badass. It's like a gun lance. I notice a lot of games start using like gun lancers now. Okay, and there's quite a bit of lag. There is no time to speak from what I see yet. It's probably like later on. So I was right, is basically fill up the gauge and use abilities. Uh, and you have ultimate abilities you can choose from. Oh, you can go ahead and hit hit us with the ban hammer. I don't think we're supposed to be doing that much damage, you know. <laughs> I don't know what those are, but let's keep going. I mean, it doesn't seem like... It seems like a game I wouldn't mind playing, at least. I wouldn't mind playing it. Okay, let's skip. Complete chapter one for a thousand crystals. Or diamonds, whichever one they go with. Oh, they took out the angel. They banned her for that damage. <laughs> we, we don't get to use her anymore. <laughs> okay, there we go. Time's too speed. Let's go up and eat thingy higher than that. Okay, that noise. Oh, God. I want to turn that down a little bit. I don't mind the music or anything, but the sound effects are, like, pretty damn loud. Okay, now I'm actually looking at this character. He actually looks pretty dope. 
not a huge fan of like the shoulder armor and how it looks, but the rest of it looks pretty badass. When I see all their art style looks really nice. Hasn't been playing for more than 14 days, but yet. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> you pretty much give, give it up on the game from what I see. If you haven't been playing for 14 days. Alright, so we got daily logins. 100 diamonds. Yeah, I've been seeing this character a lot. Well, that yellow-haired dude. Powerful units for free. Okay, so we got a beginner guides and stuff like that. Firepower summon. All right. She looks pretty dope, even with the broken sword. See the summon animation. Oh, so that's how you tell if you got something rare. Yeah, this character. I've seen him quite a lot. You get XP from that. Okay. Okay, so the green stuff is love and gup stuff. Okay, that I want to say some that stat up thing looks exactly like Fire Emblem's <laughs> like stats of how they like pretty much distribute it. I don't know. I always look kind of like that uh, way of kind of like the way that Fire Emblem did it. Not like that this game. Kinda has it. Oh no, is this like rarity up? Yeah, basically this is rarity up. It's not star up or anything like that. I think you'll probably need copies from what I'm guessing. It's telling us how to upgrade them rarity wise and level. It never told us how to, like, you know, like, star them up. But I'm going to guess duplicates. Whoa, go back. I am curious how the stamina is going to work. Because most older games like this tend to have, like, really low stamina starts. Which is what I hate in like a lot of games. Like you can only go through like a few missions. That's what I didn't like about Battle Spears. And that. What else? Brave Frontier. Brave Frontier did it too. But that was mostly for like cost teams. I'm guessing this is skip ticket. Yeah. Alright, cool, cool. So we're gonna go fuse at the blacksmith. Well, this is this is helping me to show off the mechanics. That's gonna be pretty good. All right, so put in equipment and basically level up the sword. So would it have to be the same sword? Level 2 sword. Yeah. 
All right, we got two more missions. I don't want to do arena. Buy items from trader. What does the trader have? Oh, this is also our currency too. It looks like we get a, quite a bit of stamina to start off with. So that's good. I'm not an arena type person. Holy crap, that guy is very powerful. You know what? Screw it. Let's fight this guy. <laughs> We're gonna die, but at least we die with dignity. They never said we have to win. Also, they just poof into dust. Magic rainbow dust. <laughs> Probably Discord again. Alright. So, we did some of our missions. God. Everything was just literally stamina in there. Thank you for those. Now I want to see one thing. How much does the summons actually cost? And how much is 10 summons? That's cool. Uh, let's see. Where would you find that? Trader summon. There it is. Oh, we get a free 10 summon. What? Okay. I'm down. I'm always down about the free. Ah, we didn't get anything higher than that. That's fine. Oh, we can get equipment out of there, too. Oh, oh my. Um, can we go back to that character? <laughs> Just saying. She seems like the grand prize out of all this. Oh, we already have you. Oh, did you, oh, turns into fragments. Oh, okay. Best character in the game. <laughs> oh, removes debuffs. Gain stats, okay. Increase all stats by 10%. Nullify all stat debuffs for three turns. Okay. Her limit versus 10% of average attack and magic attack as life to all damage. Yeah. Light damage to all enemies 20 times. All allies in. All allies get an increase of defense. And magic defense. Ten percent. My brain my brain is everywhere, dude. I can't think today. <laughs> okay, so this three thousand. Jesus Christ. Does she get a guarantee of a five star from this as a start off? That's pretty cool. This one is a select summon. I'll say, okay, so you get this character on step three. That's, oh, you have a chance of getting no, one of those characters. One out of four of these characters. So 25% chance. Of getting one of them. Wow, I, nah, I think that's mixed in with probably the other characters too. You have a video summon too for 10 summons. 
Okay. Well, let's do the video 10 summon then. Alright. I'm probably not gonna edit this out. I'm mistressed. Oh. Played it. I don't play it anymore. It's, it's an alright game. For me, I just like straight up gotcha games. When it comes to mobile. That's just personally me. Okay, so it was the message from Discord. Alright. Summon. So is it like a actual summon or is it just like a newbie summon that you would use with like gold? Oh no. It's actually a full on summon. That's cool. Ah, she looks pretty cool. Oh, you could do another one if you watch another video. You know, I would love to sit here and watch videos and summon, but <laughs> we still got a lot of gameplay to get through. Okay, that's that's cool. Ah, okay, I wasn't trying to actually go there. Not yet. I'd do that if I continue to play the game though. So there is uh, also a elite ticket. Hmm. Okay. Dodges easily and can confuse enemies with his skills. Attacks enemies with magic attacks, creates a barrier for herself. Alright, use her skills to petrify the back. Oh, the nearest enemy. I thought that was the back at first, but. Brain all over the place. Do the damage to units far away. Hmm. I had to think about that one. So how would you see their actual like skills and stuff? That's what I'm trying to get to. Is it here? Okay, yeah. Protects units from fire, high water resist. Okay. Do the magic damage to the nearest enemy roll. Shields against 50% of fire for all, for your heroes, okay. Deals 40% of magic damage to all enemies six times. Oh, and they get a little bit of a magic increase. It's pretty nice, pretty nice. So no auto skills, huh? So all you have is the actual like full gauge skill and the other one is pretty much your limit burst. So you only have like two things to manage. No auto skills from what I see. From what I see, but I could be wrong. Let's get her. What is this whole special challenge thing that has seven things in it? Spa coins? Hmm. 
Damn. Okay, so we get shards for this character. Yeah, as long as we do all this. Okay. Let's keep going. Waste a lot of time with that. <laughs> Jeez. Now we have extra shards for her. Hmm. I don't think there's anybody else I want to take in. Well, we'll take her in. Why not? You know, I think I thought she would be like a brawler with those hands. I thought she would be like more up close and personal. That's why I need to change the freaking sound effects. Please tell me you guys have individual settings for that. That's gonna be mad annoying. settings. Ah, oh, yes. Okay, turn those down. Like, jeez. I saw this, too. What's this? This whole glowing little red dot. Oh. Apparently there's something of season two. No, oh, this is just the event that's going on. Connect battles. Okay, apparently I can't... Oh. Starts at a certain time. Okay, what awards can you stage for? I want some good rewards. Ah, uh, okay. Ah. Oh. Was it like skins? Or characters? Apparently you can get spa characters. Okay, so we're, it's restricted to certain characters. So yeah, it's basically like skins. That's pretty cool, I guess. I think I'll definitely play this game a little bit longer, even after this video. Just to see how much I like it. I don't think it's going to take up like too much of my... Uh, Phone space. Ah, oh, okay, never mind. I thought we had enough to uh, actually go for that five star summon. Main quest. Alright, next. Seems like everything dies pretty fast right now. Like, there's not too much of a challenge at the moment. But I'm pretty sure that challenge, like, develops as we go. Alright. 
Wait, was his name Thor? Did I just realize that? Pretty sure his name was just Thor. <laughs> See, okay, so that was just oh, so there's even just normal dialogue missions too. A few games do that, not not like a whole bunch of them though. I know, um, what was it? Fantasy Tactics did it. Tactics Fantasy, whichever one it was. Okay, maybe that was a little bit more of a challenge. Your characters can die pretty quick, so times two now and then is not a good idea to have on. <laughs> Unless you're like really confident that your characters are pretty good or that you're quick on the draw. Okay, so I get that character at chapter three. Okay. I like your design, so I'll go for No, well, I'm trying to go here, not there. All right, let's do our free five-star guarantee. I want to see what colors I have to look out for when it comes to a five-star summon. All right, down we go. Okay, so it was just rainbows that we're looking out for. Noted. Got an ultra rare staff. Got to remember to put on some equipment though. I like her. She her design actually looks pretty cool. And our first five star. So they basically still keep you in suspense when it comes to you know, like your summons, basically, from what I see. All right, pretty cool. So it seems like you could do this quite a few times for a five star. That's pretty damn nice, to be honest. Really generous. How many games would do that? Okay, so here's where we get the uh, thousand. Oh, and we also get this character. Later. Later, later. Yeah, take you out. Put her. Okay, I wanted to see what her skills are. High magic damage and magic attack and lowers the enemy's gauge. So that's more of like a PvP character from what I see. Deals damage to all enemies 10 times and recovers it. Okay, so it's also a healer too. If I was to use the burst, that is. Okay. One more and we'll just end it off there. So, so far my opinion on the game is actually pretty nice. Not as bad as I thought it was going to be. But still pretty me, you know? But overall, pretty cool. And there is lag, so you probably want to turn off, like, high graphics. And if high graphics doesn't work for you, then... I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> her just hiding her little scarf. <laughs> oh, they also have the traveling, uh, well, yeah, the traveling traveler. Stuff like that.
contains some orbs and stuff. Alright. I'd say just traveling traveler. Traveler. Traveling merchant. My life right now. <laughs> Clearly I need help. Let me grab that. Grab all this. No, we can actually do one more summon soon. So I'm gonna try and, you know, cheese this a little bit more. Feel like we're pretty damn close. Congratulations to oh progression. Let me guess that's that costs. <laughs> Alright, let's go do our summon. Our last summon and we'll end it off. Down we go. Oh, we got four of them this time. Four super rares sent up. Oh, they got a harpy? I like those gloves. Super rare. Rare. Got a fire witch. Oh, our ultra rare book. Oh. Who is this for? Okay, it's not restricted to anybody, so. Oh, does our. So, equipment has extra skills from what I see then. Oh, okay. So that's our extra, like, auto skills and stuff. That makes sense. Okay, that's all of our support summons. We at least get a three-star character and up. Oh, no, a three-star character. Or just gear guarantee. Okay. Pretty cool. So you get two five-star guarantees. As your start off. Alright. With that said, guys, I'm going to be ending off there. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And to then, peace out. Shout out the game yourself if you enjoyed it.